Hello again, everybody. This is Mr. Everything, and I am coming back at you with another IL-2 Sturmovic video. And in this video, we're going to continue on with our Flying Circus Volume 1 scenarios. We had already done the hunting trip. Now I'm going to do the Bristol Fighter Bloody April. Uh, what's our mission? Anticipation of the major British offensive. Mission. We'll lead the flight. You will conduct an offensive patrol across the lines. Continue east. Return to base. Destroy all enemy aircraft you encounter. Okay, so what they're saying is this is a dog fight with a Bristol a fighter. It's an F-2. Okay. And let's do it. All right, we are in the cockpit. I'm sitting a little bit off to the left. Oh, there's my compass up here. Let's get the engine started. There's Billy. Put his goggles on. There we go. Is that my head bump rest right there? Okay. Now, I'm not number one. Captain Robinson is. Now, I've added a couple of overwing Lewis guns. Uh, which is probably going to cause me to fly a little slower than I'm probably supposed to. But that's all right. I'm not gaining. Yeah, my speed is too low. I need to uh, nose down just a little bit so that my speed will pick up. There's a balloon. That's another thing they've added in this patch. Uh, the tether, the tether line from the balloon to the ground uh, is physicalized. So if you fly through it, you will uh, cut your wings off. Uh, so just be careful of that. Yeah, see how far behind I'm lagging? And that's with a hundred percent throttle. We're making the turn on the map to cross no man's land. Uh, is there four of us? Yeah, it looks like there's four of us. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna just gonna go. Just try to keep up. But that's what happens when you add all this extra weight. <laughs> I hear ground fire artillery. Oh, wait, there's, maybe there's five of us. Six of us. How many of us are there? Maybe there's eight of us. I don't know, but all I see is six. I don't normally fly the Bristol, so this is kind of a new experience for me. Um, and that's one reason why I wanted to do these uh, missions, these solo, you know, single one-off missions, because it'll give me an opportunity to fly all these aircraft. Uh, now, I under understand that's the only flying circus 
Volume 1 vehicles uh, in those missions. Uh, Volume 2 will be coming out soon, and I'm sure they'll include their own missions as well. And you can, play, you can actually fly uh, careers with Volume 2. All right, so what I'm going to do now is just fast forward uh, and try to get as close to the objective as possible. And uh, I'll see when we get closer. All right, I'm back. Uh, I just wanted to say I was able to get into formation with these guys, but looking off to the right uh, up high, let me see if I can see them right there, uh, you can see there's a flight of uh, looks like five planes. I suspect uh, they're the enemy. But there's our, there's our flight all in echelon, and there's the flight leader. I'm in position. He's got his little streamer. Look at that. Oh, if I knew what squadron we were in, the, the double line, I would have picked it because that was an option. I think that was squadron 20. I could be wrong, though. Okay, are we going to engage those guys? Or we're just letting them get closer? What's going on? Oh, we're turning. Okay. Turned off autopilot. That was uh, making me fly in a way I don't think I wanted to. Can you do that? Can you clip through me like that? Is that is that a thing? Oh, that albatross really wants me to dive. That, a lot of these look like I don't want to lose altitude is what I'm saying okay this guy's in red that's not a Brit <laughs> I got some hits not a lot of hits but I did get some numbers, huh? I'm staying on the leader. I don't want to break... Oh, G limit reached. Yeah, I don't want to break my wings. My eye is itching like madman. Okay. 
This is this him? Oh, okay. No, it's a different guy. This guy's in orange. Maybe it's the same guy. Maybe it's just the lighting. Oh, really? You're gonna do that to me? Come on, Billy, get him. Don't waste your ammo. I think I got him. I think I got a little piece of him on that. Yeah, where'd he go? Get that gun out of my face. This is a different... Okay, my track IR is all over the place. Look at that, my truck iron will not stay centered, it just wants to droop. See, look at that. Get that gun out of my face. I can't climb. I got no engine. I'm going to give it to him. Billy, you'll tell me if there's anybody behind us, right? Yeah, it's like they're all in front of us.
That looks like an albatross. Let's see if we can't get that guy that's a little low. Return of Ace? No, I don't think so. Get him, Billy. He's like just sitting there. Yeah, this Bristol's a little hard to organ, you know, get that those crosshairs to line up. I probably should have went with an Aldis site or something. Okay, we're falling back into formation, but I think we're chasing these guys. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to fast forward until maybe we get close to their airfield or or something happens where we get back into a dogfight. Uh, yep, there's the flight leader, so I'm going to stick with him and uh, let me fast forward. I'll be right back. Okay, it looks like we're back into the dogfight. They decided to turn and uh, come after us. Go after the guy in red. That's right, go after him. My guns are overheating.
I'm gonna be out of ammo. All my guns are overheating. Yeah, look at that. It's just gonna overheat until I use up all my ammo. Yeah, look at that, used up all my ammo. First time that's ever happened to me. That's what, that's what I said to her. <laughs> Honest, this has never happened before. <laughs> I'm diving and getting out of here. And drinking some tea. Okay. I'm trying to get rid of that map. There we go. Now they're chasing me. I wonder if I can reload my Lewis guns and if they're cool now. Let's see. Nope. <laughs> that was the last 22 bullets. Okay, got it. trying not to rip my wings off. I do have a little bit of damage. It's a long ways to Piccadilly. Hopefully your guns aren't overheated. He's like, oh, are we going to make it? Look at that mustache. I won't let them get you, Billy. Looks like they turned around. They're tired of chasing me. And that must be do I. We're not leaking, that's good. I 
Yeah, with that wing damage like that, it wants to pull me to the left. There we go. Alright, so guys, what we're going to do now is, now that I think I'm pretty safe, I'm kind of low though over the, over the up front. So, um, I'm going to see if I can't climb up a little bit and get over the front and get back to base. So, uh... I will fast forward and I will see you in just a moment. Alright, so I think we've got through most of it, even though we're still under like a flak barrage. I'm going to dive, I'm going to lower my throttle and we're going to dive uh, down to any airfield, which actually I think our airfield is right in front of me, so... Guess we'll see. Let's check them out. Yeah. Le Target and Mont Saint Aloy. So Le Target looks like it's. Well, I'm not sure which one is our airfield. I'm looking at the mission. I don't see where it says. Yeah, I'm just going to land at either one. I know where Mont St. Aloy is, and I think the target is a little bit over there. Or I should say, in French, it's the target. <laughs> I want to make sure my throttle is low enough that I don't rip my wings off. I think we're just gliding pretty pretty good. I don't think we've got uh, a care in the world. I think that's our aerodrome right there. That's Mont Saint Aloy. And the target is somewhere over there. But I think we took off from Mont Saint Aloy. I, I really do. So I think that's where we're going to land. Okay, there is an altimeter. And it's like not even moving.
I'm looking for the airfield because I think I lost it. Maybe that's it right there. This thing's gonna land, but we're gonna do our best. Bottling up because I was thinking I was getting a little too low. All right, we're over the trees. Nosing it down, keeping our speed up. Wait, there's a fence. Whew. Billy, I told you we'd get you back. Look at the damage on that sucker. Hold on. Billy, you could have been killed. And then all the holes in the tail. Man, look at those. You got you got lucky, Billy. Landing successful. That's what I'm talking about. I bet you we didn't shoot anybody down. We got zero aircraft. <laughs> All right, well, that was uh, Bristol Fighter, Bloody April. And uh, we're going to intermix these with the Griffin as well, the World War II career that I'm doing, uh, campaign, actually. Uh, next one we're going to do is the Fokker DR-1. All kaput. All right, I'll catch you in the next one.